Sky Television and BSB are to merge their television operations into a single company. It will still be known as BSB, but its name will be changed to British Sky Broadcasting and will trade as Sky Television. The new joint company to be announced tonight will be controlled jointly by News International, the present owners of Sky Television, and by the present owners of BSB. The managing director of the new company will be the present chief executive of Sky, Mr. Sam Chisholm. Joint deputy managing directors will be Sky's Gary Davey and BSB's Ian Club. The merger brings to an end a satellite war, with both parties claiming tonight that there can no longer be a loser in the TV space race. Welcome to Sky. Sky was launched on the Astra satellite on the 5th of February 1989. It was a revolution in television with enormous financial risks for owner Rupert Murdoch. Well, I think it's terribly important for Britain. Uh, I think it's good for the viewers. I think it's good for British industry. Uh, I think it benefits everybody. The Sky service included a movie channel, entertainment and a 24-hour news service. This, the first bulletin. Good evening. You're watching the world news from Sky Television News on the hour every hour. And our first story this evening, 10 Britons have agreed to sell their kidneys for cash to a German count who plans to set up an organ transplant business here. Despite a crippling economic recession in Britain, it was soon clear that the gamble had paid off. Sky was a huge success with a growing and loyal audience. Then this spring, BSB was also launched as direct competition to Sky, fighting for the same viewing audience. Tonight, Sky and BSB have merged with a combined investment of one and a quarter billion pounds. I don't know all the details as yet because a lot of them have been, got, got to be worked out. Uh, the fact is though that a five channel service will continue to be available to BSB subscribers and five channel service to Sky subscribers. And overall, uh, there will be a stronger challenge to the existing broadcasters from a merged company. Does this mean perhaps that BSB has lost the satellite war? I don't think it means that there's been a winner or a loser. The fact is that both sides feel it's more prudent to pool resources and to win the battle for satellite television to get more viewers. Company bosses are confident that they can take on the terrestrial services of ITV and the BBC and win the viewing battle. A new television revolution is underway. John Cookson, Sky News. And you're with Sky News on Sky World News tonight. We're taking a short break now.